Hello Capricorn, this is your X reading for the 14th through the 20th. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Oh, I see a card down there on the table. Let's see what's going on for my Capricorns. Very same card that Sagittarius just got um, feeling victorious around some information that you guys um, have come across, I feel. Something is like eye-opening, what I'm getting here. Hmm. I feel like whatever this information is, um, before you found whatever this is out, you guys felt kind of chained down, kind of stuck in a situation. But I feel like you guys have released yourself from something here, okay? Let's see what's going on with Capricorn's X. Page of Cups. Hmm. I feel like this person's kind of wandering aimlessly um, without you guys. I feel like they are looking for the love that they felt with you, that you gave them. And, and what I'm getting here is that this person feels they, they're seeking that same type of affection and love that you guys um, gave to them. Water energy here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, okay? They're missing it and they're longing for it. What is Capricorn's perception of their ex? Capricorn's perception of their ex. Capricorn's perception. Hmm. Maybe that they are forced to, they're being forced to like face their truth. Um, they're being forced to face, you know, the information that you now have. Okay. Like they're, they're having to um, really like eat it. And I feel like before this person probably, they probably, um, were very kind of they're very secretive and they hit things and they dance around things with their words and their actions and I think now it's like they they are having to face the music that's what I'm getting okay what is Capricorn's ex perception of Capricorn their perception of Capricorn hmm. they really broke your heart that's for sure they feel like you're no longer offering, that you no longer are wanting to reconnect, get back with them, that um, right now you're just focusing on yourself, okay? That, that you're not willing to accept um, any, any loving words or, or any loving um, gestures or anything like that. It's like right now uh, you're just kind of over it, okay? Capricorn's feelings about getting back together here. If they did this to you before, oh yeah, okay, let's get that clear, let's clear it up right now, this is how they behave with you, and so now it's like they feel like you're returning the favor, like where they were once acting like, you know, they could give or take you, now you guys are, you could give or take them, but I believe like it's for real, <laughs> it's not an act, okay. Let's see your feelings about getting back together. One more shuffle. Look at that. Some mm. of you just feel like it's, it's done, it's over with. Yeah. I think that um, even though you guys, you know, you, you unchange yourself because you do have the information that you need in order to you know release yourself i think it still bothers you though everything about the situation um continues to bother you and it's like it's it's trapping you in your own um in your own prison okay and um you are you are definitely needing to release yourself from this because what's going to happen is um, this is the type of energy that kind of it, it leads to uh, depression here 
you know, beating yourself up. Constantly thinking about, you know, what you should have done or what you could have done or, you know, if you should have seen it sooner or something like that. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't feel like you guys, I think that... You know, you know the truth here. I think a lot of times you don't want to know it, though, because, you know, it's too bothersome. Let's see what their feelings are about getting back together. Capricorn's ex feelings about getting back together. Page of Swords. Hmm. I think they definitely want to talk about... Um, some things but you know this is very immature energy here with these two pages the page of cups and the page of swords very immature okay and I'm getting that you know this person probably you know watches you guys they don't speak though and I feel like they're angry they're angry because even though I feel like they really did something to hurt you for some reason, this person feels like you guys were the ones that, you know, did them wrong. But I'm not getting that whatsoever, okay? I'm getting that they're, the way they speak, the way they behave is, is very immature, you know? very immature I feel like they pout they want their way um, and that's just the bottom line with this individual and um, yeah let's see how you guys can assist this reconciliation along how can Capricorn assist this reconciliation along here hmm. just go on I feel um, and you know gain your confidence gain your confidence know that you know you can you don't have to put up with this you do not have to put up with this i feel like this is all about you guys moving forward you know lending your time to situations of people that are deserving of it okay i think this is you guys getting out i think this is you um, focusing your attention elsewhere, doing things for yourself, taking care of yourself, okay? Gaining your confidence, standing in your power, standing in your element. Oh, this is standing in your element here, okay? I'm going to take these cards and see what's going on here. Starting over, okay? Come out of this, because this, this is where you're heading, to the nine of swords constantly thinking about this situation over and over again constantly thinking about how you know you guys once were happy in this connection um, you had a, a committed relationship here hmm look at that this is a very toxic situation that was one-sided it was one-sided there was no equal give and take here there was somebody taking way too much here, okay? So even if at one point you felt like you could deal with this in order to have this Ten of Cups, to have this happy home, it wasn't that happy for you. Because there was a lot of toxic energy there. Somebody very attached to you and really sucking your energy is what I'm getting from you guys, okay? So now this is how you are. Think about what you've done wrong. The only thing that I can see here that you guys probably have done wrong is giving way too much of yourself so you can have this Ten of Cups. Way too much of yourself. Okay. So, not your fault. Not your fault. Okay. Everybody has something to do with... Um, you know when things go wrong but please don't take all the responsibility and put it on your shoulders like you should have known something um, or you should have done something differently or you know no don't do that to yourself okay let's see <clears throat> how the X can increase the chances of reconciliation here 
How can the X increase the chances of the reconciliation here? High Priestess, wow, use their intuition, use their intuition, follow their heart, be more transparent, stop being so freaking secretive, stop being so mysterious, um, come with it, come with it, I feel like they need to follow their heart, and I feel like their heart leads them right to you. Because I think part of them, you know, seeing the truth is that they didn't give you everything that they could here coming as a page. Okay? They weren't all in. They weren't devoted fully to this connection. Okay? So let's see what the potential outcome is here for you guys. The potential outcome. We have the magician there. Potential outcome for Capricorn and their ex. Two of coins is up in the air. It's up in the air. I think this depends primarily on. I think this depends on if this person actually, um, you know, matures and. And, and really like steps it up to be honest with you because I see you gaining your momentum and I see you gaining your balance and I see you being okay and I see you being okay with or without them to be honest with you but this situation is still up in the air it remains to be seen Okay, so if Pisces, Gemini, Leo, um, I think I already told you about the water signs. Any other uh, air sign is here. Libra, Aquarius as well. Okay, guys. All right, guys. So I will be speaking with you guys soon.